Hey Brian here with HBF Outdoors and today I'm going to show you how you can get yourself set up to be able to take some basic measurements when you're out in the woods without having to carry one of these because that would be awkward. So stick with me and I'll show you. Okay so one measurement that you can use that can be vital and important when you're out in the woods is your hand span. So it's a rough estimate but one of the things you can do to get that measurement is get a tape measure and measure your hand span. Now mine is roughly about eight inches. Now what I'll do to save me some time and so I don't forget is I'll use something like a field journal. This is my one tigress uh, field journal and in here I keep notes. So what I can do is write in here personal measurements and my hand span as we just measured is eight inches. Another measurement that could be important when you're out in the field, finger length. So mine is roughly about three inches. So I know that my finger length from the tip to the back knuckle is about three inches, and that could be useful. So we've got finger length, hand span, and we'll do one more. Another good uh, measurement you can take would be your foot or your hiking shoe. So roughly mine is about three, or I'm sorry, 11 inches. So that's a rough estimate. Again, I'm gonna to wanna to put that down in my field notes. That's 11 inches using this boot all the time. So I know that every time I wear these shoes, if I need to measure out 11 inches or about a foot, there we go. So there you have it, just a few tips there on how you can measure and take some basic measurements when you're out in the woods. Go ahead and take some time, get a tape measure, measure your hand span, finger length, and your foot wearing the same shoe all the time. Jot those down in a field journal similar to this. Carry that in your backpack and you'll have a quick reference to some basic measurements. Here's some other measurements you can think about taking as well to be able to carry in your field notes that could be useful while out in the woods. That would be your full arm length, arm span, and your height. So there you go. Until next time, I will catch you and get outside and enjoy life. Have a great day, guys.